<clears throat> hey, GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we are here today doing Alpha 8 Experimental. Uh, it just dropped today, and I've checked it out a little bit. It is um, almost a new game almost a new game it is so different that <clears throat> in order to actually do this um, we're just gonna go at it in a fairly easy mode um, yeah it is way harder than before to start the it's severe uh, you basically get nothing <clears throat> not even armor uh, which makes a lot of things really difficult. So it is kind of hell. Um, so can we have one called hell? And you know what? We're just going to do the default easy right now. Um, do I want to lock it to... Yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll do this anyway. We'll make it so that you got to spawn it on a pad. and There's a spawn limit. Auto minor depletion true. Okay. <clears throat> Everything else is set on easy. We're going to do easy mode to try out the new Experimental 8, uh, opening day of Experimental 8, and it's kind of crazy. You know what? Um, the only way to change the name of this is by changing the seed. So, because it's. What, I wonder if we. What if we did 666? Does that give us hell? Tuscally. Probably hell. That sounds like it, doesn't it? Uh, no, I never do that sort of thing. So, you know what? We're going to do a random, complete random seed here <clears throat> in Usk. Okay, good enough. On easy mode. Here we go. It's a randomly generated planet with a temperate environment. That's it. That's, it. That's all we get. Let's call this... Um, Alpha 8. I think this is like 8.0, right? Yeah, let's just go with that. And let's launch. <clears throat> so, uh, one thing I noticed right off the bat is um, the... The, the starting modes now on for the survival, the, the very start, the first couple days of the game are much harder, uh, which I'm not sure is going to translate into harder going through the game into medium and more difficult areas once you've already geared up in that. So I'm, I'm a little bit concerned that that the hard mode settings might be way too hard right now. Uh, I couldn't actually do it. I tried, tried it, couldn't stick the landing within like a minute. I'm like cooking dead. It's just something's bizarre. They either need to fix it or, I mean, I had like zero stamina. I couldn't even get to plants to like eat them to, <laughs> to cool myself down. It was, it was, it was whacked. It was whacked. Um, fastest death I ever had and it wasn't even it was just I just instantly overheated okay so we're gonna do this because it gives us stuff and it tells us where to go um, so we we want to check out the inventory okay wow gives us a purify water okay well you know what and that's all we start with now bandages antibiotic ointment flashlight and a survival tent so not much <clears throat> pretty barren now it's telling us to check out the uh, the suit that we're wearing, but technically we're just kind of wearing pajamas, right? Isn't isn't it? Isn't it just pajamas? Like, come on! Wow, they're throwing us down on this planet in our pajamas. No wonder we're we're gonna barely survive. I mean, this is like n you know naked and afraid, right? Uh, so check our suit constructor. Right now we can make 
emergency O2. So this is this is how we can make emergency O2 for the cost of nothing but time. And so that is built right into the character now. Their their pajamas make oxygen. Okay. Retrieve from exhaled air and sweat by a respirator module built into your suit. So, so your pajamas are actually kind of what are powered then, right? And then, and then the armor just fits over top, I guess. Okay. So you got power pajamas, right on. And they can make a survival tool. So we need to make this. So let's make that. <clears throat> You see that we start with zero oxygen because we don't have armor on. We don't have a helmet. So that's really interesting. Um, and you can see this costs us nothing to build. Other stuff does cost. So we can we can make we can make food with our pajamas and uh, plant protein. From vegetables, which can then be turned into power bars. Okay. So, okay. Well, that's cool. Vegetable juice. You can make juice, but you need just vegetables. Okay. Nice. And berries. So, there are, so see that body temperature minus one. So berries, berry juice will bring down your body temperature, but it costs three berries for minus one. It just increases your your health quite a bit more than a single berry, but a single berry does minus one already. And if you're overheating, well, we're at 20. Um, okay, so we also get this survival tent. So at night we can step into the survival tent and sleep until daylight. Uh, I tried it out and you, you just, oh, we're tracking an unidentified distress signal. Here we go. <clears throat> so two kilometers away, there's a wreckage. Okay, so we gotta get to this. There's small wreckages over there, but I think we, we actually, this is how you get to your personal container. Uh, those other wreckages that you just randomly find do not have your personal container. This one that gets marked by the quest or the mission. So if you don't accept the mission, you're not going to find it. It's usually a couple kilometers away. So we got a trek there because right now we got nothing. We've got uh, this survival tool and a tent and you know a bandage and a bottle of water and some pills oh no some ointment dermal burn frostbite open wound necrosis so there's some new states in the game uh, and there's a new state tree too that we can we'll look at eventually here too but it's or you can actually go right to the uh, website um, Imperian game and it will uh, show you the, the, the tree of healing stuff. Um, hmm, interesting. Okay, and then a flashlight. So the flashlight carried over. It's just a new model for it. So everything's kind of got all new skins for the most part. Uh, except for the pajamas. They look the same. Okay. So let's start before we die here of like starvation or something. So we're just going to leave our escape pod there. So, so actually at night we could, if we were around this area, we could like enter, so we could enter it and sleep inside left shift F, but it'll only let us sleep at night. Okay. <clears throat> Fair enough. So let's trek. Um, we don't have any jetpack, so we, all we can do is just run at this point. 
And what we want to do is we want to look for stones on the ground, little stones on the ground. Okay, so this is some of the new stuff. So this is plant protein now. And that's um, used to make lots of the food items, obviously. Okay, nothing in there. Okay, so... Uh, stamina management is going to be something in the game right off the bat with this uh, survival tool. The, oh, see, I see some stones over here, so let's go get these. And, oh, those guys are running away from me. So that's some of the new AI. I spooked them and they ran away. So kind of cool. I haven't really came across many plants to pick yet, but I see some berries there. So, Okay, so we can, we can actually smash these stones with this survival tool. Now you can see it eats up stamina doing it. So that's the trade-off with this tool is it eats your stamina. Didn't I see another one right around here somewhere? Thought I saw another one. Oh, more of these small wreckages all over the place. So this, this starting zone on the map, let's go to the map here. So the starting zone on the map has I guess it's it's probably this area right here. And it's quite huge. As you can see, this is like two kilometers away from us, and we're right there. So you can see the map is much larger now. Way, way larger. So these little puddles are actually good sized lakes. Those are those are some that's pretty decent. The, there's probably seaweed in that. Even in some of these smaller ones, they're probably deep enough to have seaweed. They're they're way bigger than they look like on the map now. So we're going to head over there because um, that's where all our gear is. That's that's where our survival constructor is uh, and some, some extra stuff in there, some sprouts and whatnot. Okay, well, we'll get nothing from there. Okay, here we go, fiber. So this is what you need now to actually get biofuel is fiber and you can get fiber from trees now I can't harvest trees at this point I don't think so can I from surface rocks no yeah I don't think this is gonna do it I mean it looks like it is it's eating up my stamina <clears throat> Stamina is just getting nuked by it. And... Ate my complete thing of stamina. Yeah, I don't think you can get trees with this thing. <laughs> okay. Wow, where... This, okay, we're getting down into an area where there looks... Ooh, what's that over there? Just a big rock? Okay, just a big rock. And you can see the train now. It's just way cooler, eh? So I have the tree detail set to low, which is the old tree models. Uh, for recording, I can't do the higher tree models. That just It's not that I have a potato of a machine. It just really... To crank out 1080p stuff with all that stuff going on and a little bit of shadows, it really, really makes it not smooth, put it that way. Come on, where's all the stuff to pick? Oh, there we go. Okay, so that that's some of the new stuff. Buds, they're needed. Buds are always needed. Okay, um... We could smash this rock. Oh, did I scare that guy? And it just gives you crushed stone now. So those rocks just give you crushed stone. But if you look in the in your suit and no. Does it not 
can you not with, oh, maybe it's only the, the survival constructor? Is it only the survival constructor that can turn that into? Okay. Huh. I guess it's only the survival constructor. You can, you can, you can make a survival constructor with ore, which is good, which we might think about doing. But you can actually turn the stone that you collect from these rocks into ores also at a cost. So I think it's um, uh, I think it's 25 stone for one silicone ore. Uh, 50 iron, 50 for one iron, and 75 for one copper. I think. I think. Can't remember. I just kind of just glanced over on it really quick, and that's what I remember anyway. So we're picking all these buds. So it's these. It's these new stand. Well, not really new, but they leave a. It's those blue modeled plants. Not all of them are pickable though. Just the ones that stand up more. See, so compared to that one, that one's laying down. This one's kind of standing up. I can pick this one, but I probably can't pick... Oh, there's a stone here. Silicone. We'll get that. Yeah, see, I can't pick that. But this one's standing up. I should be able to pick that. Yeah, buds. Oh, meteorite, really? Huh. Meteorite depletion iron, meteorite random none. Um, hmm. Okay, that might be a bug. Now, that's a big stone over there. I'm not going to bother trying to smash that. That'll, like, s take probably three whole bars of stamina to do or something. It just, just doesn't seem worth it. But this one I should be able to smash. And you still need crushed stone to make cement and everything. So um, a lot of the construction materials are are pretty much the same, or at least it seemed to be. The food was the, the one, you know, all the plants and stuff. Uh, how to get biofuel, though, that is fiber now. You need fiber. So I need to either chop down a tree or pick fiber, which is right here. There we go. Come on, where's all the little stones? I don't see any. Come on, really? Is this like a dud seed? Wow, it's on the other side of a lake, okay. Well, that's interesting. Let's go over by by the swampy area. I'm not sure if this is a safe zone anymore. <clears throat> I'm not even sure if there are. Oh, really? Oh, that one's not ready. Okay. And then this is what does this give you? Herbal leaves. Interesting. Level three. Good. Oh. There's a rock. There's some rocks here. Okay, so there's a bunch of rocks here. But they're not... They just give stone, right? Yeah, okay. So I'm not necessarily needing all the stone right now. I just... I have a feeling I'm going to need to stay close to this water. <laughs> Now, yeah, it's on easy, so it doesn't affect you that much, but this, they've made, they, they've really ramped up the difficulty, can't pick that, okay. They've really ramped up the difficulty on the start here for um, the environmental impact on on the game uh, when you have no suit <laughs> or no, uh, no armor on. Wow, it's 
makes even um, an easy start not a guaranteed win, <laughs> so to speak. Or at least right now. Who knows? Okay, why? No, none of those are ready? That's just mean. Wow. It's like somebody came through here before and picked them all. Okay, so that was natural sweetener and eggs. So they still got eggs. You just pick them up on the ground now from nests. Okay. really want to find a lot more fiber because I have a feeling I'm going to need the biofuel if I ever if I'm ever able to make a drill or get a drill or looking for a kua berries just don't see any they they really stick out now okay so I'm finding lots of deposits over there that's good so that's the other thing too there's no real deposits where you crash land it's all at the um all at the wreckage some silicone so there's probably going to be a copper maybe a promethium around here soon <clears throat> can't really do anything with those right now because i don't have a drill the survival tool is not capable of that it can just it can only smash rocks so Oh, is that it? Only gave me one? Okay. Yeah. Um, just way different now. Way, way, way. Oh, what's that? That was a silicone. So those little stones are guaranteed that specific type when you smash them with it because you when you hover over it with the tool it tells you now I wonder if um, this seed I wonder if the the mine type if it's going to be voxel or the SSC the um, the tiny little deposits all together. I think they called it the SSC or something like that. Um, I wonder if they're going to have that mixed. One of the seeds that I just tried, it was mixed. The pro Promethium was those nuggets and the the other deposits were just were the old style voxel open pit dig it out type thing. So and another thing, you can't spawn your drone. There's another object in the spawn area. I even tried with my, once I, I actually got a uh, light armor going on one of the, just before this recording on a different uh, start. And I still couldn't spawn my, my drone so I'm not sure if that's a bug now I, I can't do anything about that that's just so disappointing right now <clears throat> okay we need this stuff this is now spice and spice can lower your temperature and produce other beneficial things so we need to collect that stuff ah there we go here's some berries there's some berries. Same with over here. Here's some berries. Elderberries. They're not Akua berries anymore. I guess because uh, Akua is a thing of the past. It. Uh, I don't even know if you... I guess if you know a specific seed that that name comes up on, then you can... Uh, Keep running that seed, I guess, and always have a kua. <laughs> but um, I'm not sure if it actually exists. I haven't even got off planet uh, in this 
rendition. So get the spice, it's very important. Just not seeing very many stones. So let's hurry up to this wreckage. We're actually, oh, see that? We're, we're getting cold now. Of course we are. I think it, it'll get warmer if we go down further, but I need to get to this wreckage. I really need it. You can see my food is going down much faster now because um, my temperature is, is going down. And I need the stuff in here to be able to um, counter that, really. How do I get up in here? It's out of jump. Okay, come on. Oh, there it is. So there we go. <coughs> There's our survival constructor. We've got a motorbike. We've got some more water. Okay, so I need to make some stuff right off the bat to keep myself from dying. I need hot beverages. As many as I can make. And how many can I make? Not many more. And my temperature, yeah, see it's eating up my food super fast now. And that's gonna lower my temperature, so that's uncool. Uh that gives me no food really. So I gotta make food. So let's make plant protein. Didn't have much plant protein. Health 90. That one doesn't give any food, but it does. Okay, huh. it heals you. So the berry juice is for healing. Okay, we might have to use the tent. We actually might have to use the tent here. And skip today, because we're freezing. And I'm not really sure what to do about that. We're like... <sighs> I guess I gotta run to the water? Okay, let's make a marker then. Um, which is closer the way I'm facing, up that way, or back that way, or this larger one. Let's do the larger one. It's a lot further, though. Oh, oh crap. Uh, yeah, that's not good. Okay, let me out. And drink that, keep myself from, damn. Okay, so I need to find um, where the frickin' plant protein. And we need, we need water, yeah. So let's just head over here. Okay. You can see, I, I mean, I'm on, I'm on easy mode, and and I'm dying here. <laughs> it's it's crazy. <sighs> this is the type of management you have to do hard mode on Omicron. I'm telling you, before it was now easy mode is uh, like hard mode. <laughs> Come on, really? <laughs> oh my God. <sighs> and that's it for my, and you can see I'm my, my stamina is just, just <sighs> wailing down. So I gotta, I gotta like, I don't know. I don't even know how I'm going to get there. I guess I got to jump on my bike and just wail. That's it. We just got to freeze. Whoa. Oh crap. Come on. 
And oh, my temperature is okay. Ah, because I got lower. Aha, so it was all elevation. Okay. Hmm. Whoa. Um, here, let's jump off because that was freaky. Yes, the alien tower wants us to check out the... What? Okay. Um, okay, let's just pick that up. <laughs> Bit of a video bug there. Hmm. Oh, some regular rocks. Well, okay, so now that I got this going, I'm not f freezing all of a sudden. Should we go back into scavenge mode while we can? I think I got to, don't I? And I'm not even sure if going to the water is a good idea at this point. Is that going to take me to a different zone? It looks like it might. Uh, but I'm just going to freeze up there. See, I'm almost freezing. It's like I can only handle it a little bit colder. But everything's up there that I need. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to make it cold on me. Huh. Not really sure what to do here. We need to find more resource stuff, and those are nodes up there. Like, I need those. But they're too high up. <laughs> it's like, really? Is this just going to troll me like this? My, my start is going to be impossible to get resources? Come on. Ugh. Okay, well, I guess we're heading down to the water. I'd really not sure what else to do. Oh, this is, ah, I see. This is indented. Huh. So... Hmm, this is just a little puddle over here, then. Maybe we'll get lucky and there'll be some, like, shallow seaweed and stuff. So this is that tiny little puddle that would have been a... Here, I'll show you on the map can't even see it but that would have been much larger in the alpha 7 let me tell you on the map <clears throat> now I'm not sure yeah 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 can we can we get down here and pick stuff before we suffocate okay swim 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 go like this swim okay um, really we're freezing, but we're in the water. Oh, come on. So is the water freezing? The water was freezing? Really? Is it? Yeah, it seems to be. Wow, okay. Huh. Okay, kind of screwed there, too. <laughs> I think I'm, I, I think this is probably a bust. Um, that's funny. Yeah. Uh, so, well, let's, I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I can't go up, can't go down. Stuck in the middle. Uh, there's a song about that. I don't want to go to the alien tower right now because I got nothing. I want to head back up where I can pick stuff. Stupid game. Trolling me, not letting me. Come on, really? <laughs> God. Oh, there's something. 
Ugh, but I can't because my stamina is gone because I'm getting too cold. Oh, come on. <laughs> stamina management. Oh, and now I'm getting super hungry and I'm getting too cold. That's probably a bad thing to eat then, but that's really all I got. You got indigestion. Ugh. Really? How do I get rid of indigestion? Crap, that's going to kill me. Uh, I think I'm screwed. I'm freezing. I need to get to food. I can't go, go into the water to get any because it freezes. <laughs> I got no oxygen. Like, what the hell? Come on, people. This is crazy. This doesn't make any sense. I mean, why why are they starting you with no with no armor, with no oxygen even? And con like the the temperatures are unrealistic as as a start. Then like I don't get it. And this is on easy, really? <sighs> okay. Well, they got some tweaking to do, obviously, because <laughs> I already tried hard and it was completely unplayable. Like this, but but it was much faster. Like within a minute, you're dead. It's like, um, um, hello? <laughs> yeah. There's nothing to pick down there. Do I just go back up and suicide? You know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? This is stupid. I'm going to use my tent. Call it a day. There we go. Let's pick it up. I should have done that earlier, maybe. And I still got indigestion. Are you kidding me? And everything spoiled. Oh, yeah. Um, I got vegetables. Can I plant protein? Yeah, I'm going to die. <laughs> I'm going to die. This is sad. Spice. Come on, eat it. <gasps> I'm going to freeze because of this, but plant protein. I need three of those. Where did that come from? Vegetables. Okay. Great. Everything I had spoiled when I went to sleep. Okay. But my spice is still feed me. That's good. Got some natural sweetener. Okay. Crazy. Again. Dying on easy. What? I'm cold again? Oh, come on. <laughs> Holy crap, Batman. Did, did, am I just not allowed to stay in the the, the uh, starting area? Like... <sighs> Man, I guess I just gotta pick everything. What was that? Those vegetables. Okay, good. Need them. <sighs> you gotta be kidding me. Look at the temperature. It keeps going down. <laughs> it keeps going down. Oh my God, it's, you know, it, it's getting into the mid, you know, mid morning and the temperature keeps going down. So this variable biome temperature thing is really crazy. Um, can't find any stones. This is just, this is just turned into a real grind here. This is, I'm, hmm. I'll hold my tongue, but it's, I don't know, spending, spending an hour and not even, not even having a suit of armor or, or a, a drill yet. Like, really? Really? 
Yeah. And I can tell I'll be making my own custom starts to this as <laughs> if this is what the starts are like, because, you know, starting without a suit of armor is stupid. And even if you can make one, you need a armor locker to put one on. And what is with the temperature thing? This is just as out of control. Come on. I don't know. I don't know. A little, a little bit crazy, really. It's a little bit crazy. First day of an alpha. It's always fun. It's always so unbalanced and screwed up. Oh, there we go. We're getting some temperatures now that we're getting higher elevation. I just, I don't know. I don't know. I'm so confused right now on the mechanics of this game. It's not that the temperatures aren't, they're just completely erratic all over the place. You walk five feet and the temperature drops 10 degrees. Okay, there's stuff to pick over there at least. Eventually baddies are going to show up and kill me because, you know, I, I can't get enough stuff together to actually make anything, let alone a gun. At least these guys aren't going to kill me. Hopefully. So I wonder how much grace time we have in the starting area here. Ah, oh, your food just goes crazy here, doesn't it? Just make a couple of those. Come on. What's going on? Why is it not doing it? Hmm. Um. I don't know how to turn it on. Oh, really? Wow. That. Um. Okay. So that was a harsh delay. Is what that was. <laughs> okay. Let's see some more spice over there. There's those herbivore creature things. Not really sh sure if uh, I want to take anything like that on with no weapons besides this little zapper. Besides a taser. Because that's all this thing is. Okay. Hmm. Well, I'm not dead yet. We are getting resources now that we're back up here. That was a little concerning for half a day there when I couldn't get back up here because of the temperature. Okay, I need more of the plant protein. Yeah, of course, I'm out of, God, it's just, it's just a constant struggle with stamina nowadays, it's just, <clears throat> it's just they added one more game mechanic to kind of screw you up, now that's not worth any food, is it, no, so I gotta use that to eat, oh, come on, really, 
Use herbal leaves. I thought I had some of those. Mushrooms. Aloe vera. Natural sweetener. Oh, they must have spoiled. Yeah. Vegetables. Buds. They're going to spoil too eventually. Eh. Indigestion, really? That's going to screw with my stamina, I bet, isn't it? And my food. Yeah, my food is just dropping super fast right now. Yeah, this has turned into a real grind, and this is on easy. Yikes. Yikes. You gotta spend hours just running around picking flowers at first? Because that's pretty much all they give you. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Like food of five. Yeah, that doesn't help. Poisonous bite. Your stamina went up quite a bit though. Fifty-five. Oh, did that get rid of my ingest? No. Okay, I'm gaining stamina, so that's okay. <sighs> okay. Well, what do we got in the way of five iron? Silicone, so we do have enough to actually make something now, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Um, fiber, can we, can we like, well, let's check it out. Let's throw our constructor down. Put the stuff in here. Um, make in the way of food so pretty much oh it can do meat it can make meat from plant protein and vegetables very cool okay spoil food what do you need that for in a survival constructor for I don't know what you need spoil food for anymore other than maybe um oh well I'm really hungry again Freaking indigestion. God, it's just, look at my food level. It's just, it's going ridiculous. I gotta eat those as food. Can I eat these? Do they do anything? No. Ugh, I need something to get rid of the indigestion. <laughs> Spice. Oh, an indigestion. There we go. God, I had it all along. Really? Derp a derp. Okay, so spice gets rid of indigestion. Okay. Okay, so let's do this. What can we make? Can we make a drill? No, because we don't have enough for electronics. Really? Copper. Oh. That's why. <clears throat> yes, we can make a drill. Okay. Hopefully. It looks like it can. <laughs> oh, you know what? I should probably um, take some stuff here. Let's go in and... Hmm, you know what, for tools, I think we need the, I don't know, <laughs> uh, multi-tool, I guess? Hello, I have nothing, to, the ore scanner, yeah? Just in case we run into those weird ones. I've already got a survival constructor, but you can learn how to make them now at third level. Uh, what about assault rifle? I can't really make that yet. Really, I can't do much. I 
can't really do much. Uh, I'll do the assault one anyway then. Screw it. Okay. So, there it is. We have a drill. Um, we, we had a drill. It, where'd it go? Really? It, it deleted itself. <laughs> Do we have enough for a, okay, well, I guess we'll race, we'll waste all of our, I'm not even sure if it made it. Did it make it? I don't even know now. Oh, you know what? I stopped it from making it. I must have clicked on the Q. Oh, right. Okay, so it wasn't actually. Okay. Hmm. Not sure if that's a video bug, but you can't actually see it doing anything. And if you click on it, it stops it. Oh, wait. That's. Wait. Uh, did, okay. Was that deceiving? It looked like it queued up all the stuff and made it, and I didn't have it turned on. <laughs> I, okay. <sighs> yeah, alphas are awesome. Okay, we have a drill, and I think we can make biofuel. Yes, from plant fibers, so we can make two. Two, wow. Okay. <clears throat> um, can we make an ore scanner? Yes. Okay, let's make the ore scanner too. Oh, this is going to perish really quick here. we got to get out there and start picking more food real quick. Come on. So it took me all day to make a drill, an ore scanner, and two biofuel. Wow. <sighs> On easy mode. Now this might have been just a horrible place to start and I just didn't get enough stones and I, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it, whatever the case may be. But you know what? We're going to leave it here. Um, I'm going to call this an episode. This is this has gone on way too long anyway. Uh, so, well, you can see it's, it's way, way harder now and much more of a grind at the beginning um, that might actually scare away a few new people the, the this wicked grind at the beginning and the like the, the pretty much <laughs> run around and find a find a warm spot on the planet to stand on thing is a little weird um, so that's a little bit schizophrenic and and uh, it kind of slows you down a lot too. So it's like you know, starting without a armor to even protect you at all, kind of weird. I'm um, not really sure why they did that, but I guess it's an option, right? Uh, it's probably not an option that I'll be liking, and I'll probably make my own custom <laughs> scenarios because of it. But we'll see. Maybe it'll grow on me. You know, like mold. Or like warts. Probably more like warts. Well, guys. There we have it. Day one, I'm still alive. Level four, zero kills, zero deaths, zero anything. I have a drill and some biofuel and an ore scanner. So I can actually go mine those deposits now. 
is is that crazy or what? Eh? And I got to pick a whole bunch of food. <sighs> well, I guess I'm I'm started, right? I I got a I got a drill and some bio fuel and an ore scanner and a survival constructor. It's like a it's like I just started. It's like <laughs> just etch a sketch everything that I just did, and now we actually start. So next episode is is episode one and <laughs> oh god okay guys well if you like this episode uh, give me a like if you want to see when the next episode is published make sure you subscribe and turn, turn your notifications on well guys uh until next time you ha guys have yourselves an awesome awesome day <laughs>